Hi and welcome to today's session on scale drawings. So when we are looking at scale drawings, what they actually are, they are representations of objects drawn in proportion to their real size. So when, uh, when we're looking at scale, what we need, uh, need to do is uh, work out the size of the actual object, size of the drawing, and then work out the proportion, which is a scale factor. So scale picture of a 10p coin. Here's my 10p coin just here. So 0.5 centimeters equals one millimeter in real life. So this coin has a diameter of 12.2 centimeters. So now our problem is what is the diameter using this scale drawing of an actual coin? So one centimeter equals two millimeters, which is what we've got from here. Because if we double both of these, doubling uh, half a centimeter is a centimeter, doubling one millimeter is two millimeters. This is just to make it easier for the calculations. So 12.2 times that by two, because centimeters, turning it into millimeters, times it by two, will give me 24.4 millimeters. And that is the diameter of a 10p coin. And of course, this would become the key. So here's uh, another, another example using uh, a well-known Transformers character. So his actual height is 10 meters tall. The scale drawing height is 20 centimeters tall. So we could use the scale of 20 centimeters equals 10 meters. So I've actually simplified this by dividing both of these two by 10 to two centimeters equals one meter. So this has actually became, became our key on our drawing. And we could use this to actually draw any other part of, uh, of this because if it was given any other dimension of, uh, of the real, uh, real life, we could use the key to create the um, corresponding drawing. So using uh, this as our scale factor, we're gonna take the actual size and we're gonna divide it by the scale size. So 10 divided by 20, that gives me 0 0.5. Now, as you can see, this is a decimal. So what this is actually doing is it's reducing the size of the original shape. But we've uh, just got to bear in mind that when, uh, when we've got our, got our answer, we've got to convert it from meters, taking away the meters and put in centimeters. We could also use them um, on uh, map drawings. So here's a, a problem where the Black Panther is using a plan of a room um, for a rescue. And he's going to, um, on this plan, he's got a scale of one to 20. So this means for every centimeter on the plan drawing, on the blueprints, is going to actually be 20 centimeters in real life or 0 0.2 meters. So the scale drawing length is 18 centimeters in length and a width of 12.5 centimeters. And of course, he needs to now use this to try and, try and find the actual length of the room. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna take our 18, which is our scale drawing, and we're gonna multiply that by 20 to give us our actual size, which gives us 360 centimeters. Or some of us like to work in smallest, uh, smallest um, form, simplest form, in which case I'd reduce this to 3.6 meters. The width is 12.5, so multiplying that by 20 gives me 250 centimeters or 2.5 meters. If you like what you see, please subscribe. Thank you very much for watching.